Welcome back everyone, it's King Kobe here. So thank you all for your tremendous support for watching my videos, liking my videos and sharing my videos as well. Right? But I still want to plead with all of you that my statistics shows show me that a large number of my viewers are not my subscribers yet. We have about 70 to 80 percent of my viewers not being my subscribers. You letting me know that I'm offering value to you is subscribing to my YouTube channel, and that is what is going to also motivate me to keep doing it. So that is your also little way. That is your little way of showing appreciation to the content that I do. Right. So let's get into today's business. So in my previous video that I did on how to edit your sample and also apply effect on your samples, um, I received a lot of feedbacks that they can't find the effects, right? The effects bar in their sample bank or in their sample section, right? So this is this will be the purpose of the video. So usually when you open the virtual DJ, your samples look like this. So you don't have any sample bar, right? So to activate the sample bar or to show the sample bar, you just have to click on the small dots that you have here. That's the combo, you know, the small combo button here. Click on it and you will see what show effect like this. So here you are able to have your effect bar in your, your sampler section or your sample section, right? So you have a number of effects here that you can use. So to play or to use a sample, you will have to have the, sorry, to apply the effect on the sample, you have to make sure that the effect is selected, right? And then you can now play this, this thing called the code. Right, then you can now play the sample. So whilst it's selected, every sample that you play, every sample that you play will have the effects applied. Right, so if you wouldn't want it to be applied, then you have to click on it to deactivate it before. But whilst it's selected, so I normally like the so, and you can see that I have quite a number of them selected. So I can just click on these combo switches to turn them off. Right, so I used to have the echo and the flanger on, which I've turned them off. Right, so I can just turn on the echo, and then this is King Kobe. I can have it um only the the echo activated you get it so that is also basically about a sampler effect i hope this helps kindly hit on the subscribe button if you haven't done that and also like and share my videos to other virtual dj enthusiasts be sure to turn on your notifications so that you'll be notified anytime i drop a new video so the name is Sokin Kobe and I will come your way with another video. But till then, stay safe.